Chairman Kaguya Sumiragi of the UFN Supreme Council, I desire that the Holy Britannian Empire participates in the United Federation of Nations. Master Zero, do you understand that participation is dependent upon a two-third majority vote of UFN members? Of course. That's the democratic way of doing things, right? Yes, that's right. This is rather uncourteous, don't you agree? It was former Emperor Charles who carried out all those crimes, wasn't it? Gios countermeasures, huh? Well, now it's clear that only Kaguya and the core members of the Black Knights know about Gios. Hmm? Now, what are you really trying to do here, treacherous Emperor Lelouch? I'm surprised at you. Isn't the New Britannia a better country for the entire world? That remains to be seen. UFN resolutions are always determined by majority vote. Voting rights are apportioned according to each member nation's population. The Chinese Federation has been broken up, so the nation with the largest population in the world now is Britannia. If we allow Britannia to join the UFN today... You will have more than half the votes, Emperor Lelouch. In short, if we vote in your favor, you would usurp our power and take control of the UFN. So that's it! I always knew he was a bad guy! He really is exceptionally dim, isn't he? I heard that! What's your response, Emperor Lelouch? Break up your empire. Let your territories secede from Britannia. Or limit your total votes to 20%. Those are your options. Chairman Kaguya, I have one question that I would like to ask you. You may do so. What trait is most important for governing the world? It's pride. The pride of self-governance. Good answer. <laughs> you speak with wisdom, Lady Kaguya. However, I would submit a different answer. Oh, and what would that answer be? The will to destroy. Destroy? Destroy the world, and even oneself! Careful, he's trying to pull something! <sighs> not allow this affront to his majesty where the hell were our perimeter guards sorry sir he launched suddenly from underwater is he gonna make the leaders of the entire world obey him at gunpoint deploy to ashford academy we need to save lady kaguya the britannian forces have started to move what's that they're crossing from international waters into japanese territory he's caught us off guard meeting with the ufn and then choosing the school as the site all of this was nothing but a decoy. If that's true, then he's betrayed the trust of the entire world. You heard him. He was never interested in joining the UFN. In other words, his goal is a pure dictatorship. He abolished the old aristocracy, yet he still continues to call himself Emperor. You're right. Zero is. Lelouch is now the enemy of the world. Retreat! Get out of there, Koski! Negative. I'm taking Lelouch down. This Guren's the only unit that can go up against the Lancelot. If you fight here, you'll be putting everyone's lives at risk. There are leaders from every nation on Earth. But the Empress is also in grave danger! I know that, Colin. But the enemy is Lelouch. He won't hesitate to kill everyone around him. You can't act on your own. We have to let the representatives decide how to respond. Otherwise, the UFN itself will collapse, and that would leave Britannia victorious! Suzaku. Now, Chairman Sumiragi. <laughs> I request that you take the vote. Will you allow Britannia to join the UFN? We'd be voting under duress. Will you stop them from casting their decision? <laughs> no. Then let's start the democratic process. <laughs> Lelouch and Suzaku, what are they thinking? They declared war on the whole world! Huh? 